Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Evan. Hit that subscribe button and consider liking this video and also check out my Amazon affiliate link down below. In today's video, I'll be going over how you can enable your digital speedometer on your BMW E46. This video also applies to other cars because I will be showing you a tool that you can use to enable the digital speedometer. So if you guys do have a BMW E46, E38, or E39, you'll also be able to enable a digital RPM. So you can see that on your actual instrument cluster. Now, I didn't know that the E46 could do this for for the longest time I thought it wasn't able to have a digital speedometer as well as a digital readout of your RPMs. Unfortunately it cannot be coded as something that you do have to go into the menus, but on the newer BMWs you can code it using a tool that I will show you guys after I show you guys how to enable it on the E46. So let me show you guys that now, it's super simple. All right, so to enable the actual cluster to be able to show your digital speedometer, it's super simple. So right here you see this button right here, hold it down while the car's on. Once it says test, keep pressing the button until 19 pops up. Wait a second. Press it again and then go all the way, Click, keep clicking test again until you get to seven. Wait a second. Then it's gonna say test, it's gonna say 7.0, press it once, 7.1, 7.2, now 7.2 is your RPM. You can see the RPM on the screen. So if I give it some gas. Guys, don't mind my super loud car. I currently have my exhaust cut off from doing my clutch, but that will be fixed. So if we press it again, we're in 7.3. Now this will show me how fast I'm going in kilometers. Yes, unfortunately it is in kilometers. I haven't found a way of making it in miles per hour, but hopefully this helps out my European viewers. I mean, even if you're in the US, it's kind of cool. I'm more, I was more curious about having the digital RPM. So let's show you how this works. So it's gonna be tough to do while I'm driving, but so if you see, if I go faster, you can see my digital readout of my speedometer and how fast I'm going on the dash. So that's really all that is to enable the digital speedometer and digital RPM readout on the E46 as well as the E39, E38. However, there are some more features you can do with the cluster. If you'd like to see all the features that you can do with the BMW E46 cluster, I can make a video about that. There's plenty of videos online, but if you guys wanna see another one, I will absolutely make a video on that. Now, I do wanna go over how you can do this on other cars, some of the newer BMWs as well. Now, if you do have a newer car and would like to code the digital cluster to always be on there to have your digital speedometer read out you can do it with this tool called Carly now I have plenty of videos going over how to use Carly so I'm not gonna actually show you in this video nor can I code it because I have an E46 but this application this little adapter with the application allows you to do such coding features I will link the videos for Carly down below and as well to buy this adapter guys Carly is a lifesaver I use it on my E46 all the time unfortunately the E46 just doesn't support the way it codes it as you can see it's more built into the cluster and doesn't communicate with anything else in the car at least that's how I think it works and why you can't code it it seems pretty restrictive of what you can do on the onboard computer on the BMW E46 just because I think it's its own unit doesn't communicate with other functions of the car and which is why you can't do it. I mean at least that's what I think but if you guys do want to check out Carly link down below it's a great product and I absolutely love what it can do and I wish it could do this on the E46 but unfortunately just hardware limit limitations from it being such an old car so guys check that out down below all right, everyone, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video of showing you how you can enable a digital speedometer on your BMW E46. Now, I know this was a very quick video. I just actually found out about this. I never knew this was possible until I was just scrolling the forums and saw that you can enable a digital speedometer as well as a digital RPM readout, which I'm more interested in having the digital RPM readout on my dash than having the speedo because the speedo is in kilometers and doesn't necessarily do much for me since I am in the US. If I find any other features out on the cluster and what else you can do. I'll be sure to make a video on it, but I did want to inform you guys on that. So if you guys have any questions at all, drop them in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.